You check all seven categories off, you'll get a free night at your next day at Baker's. <laughs> oh, Clayton's. Oh, Josh, 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 Josh. Oh, yeah. No. Man, that fish had some speed. <laughs> These people are all gonna shut their mouths. Let's go, bro. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Baker's Backcountry Brawl. I've assembled the finest anglers and Mac Mulligan, and we're going out on the ice. I'm pretty fine. <laughs> Here's the plan. We got Mac Mulligan, lead guide at Baker's Arrows Lodge. We got Clayton Schick, CSO Adores. These guys both got YouTube channels, check them out. We got Josh McFadden from Catch and Cook. We got Keevan, I'm not sure what Keevan does, but he's joining us as well. And we are trying to do a backcountry challenge of sorts. We've got seven categories, the same seven categories as Game of Inches, and it's a time trial. So here's the deal. As soon as we catch a fish, we can move on to the next one. So we're not looking for the longest, we're just looking to check off all the boxes. We've got stock trout, we've got burbot, we've got walleye, we've got pike, we've got whitefish or cisco, we've got lake trout. What did I miss? Perch. That might be the toughest, actually. No, no we we got got Okay, these guys are confident. Here's the deal. You catch all seven species with oh, your crew. Yeah. I don't care how big your crew is. You check all seven categories off, you'll get a free night at your next day at Baker's. If you beat our time, you get a day with the legend Mac. Right? And it has You're to good. be guided. Has there has to, yeah. to be a guide to make sure everything yeah, is You can't real. do this on your own because otherwise they, they can't verify if you actually caught all or beat us or did it over a week. We're trying to do this in a day. So yeah, yeah we've got five of us. Um, we are gonna go to our furthest lake. When we drop the lines, that's when the time will start and we're gonna just fish our way back. Or what, what are we starting with, Mac? First of all, we're going to, we have walleye potential, whitefish potential, perch potential, and pike potential. And we'll go from there, see what Spike we can do. Potential. I like it. Was that okay? Did we hit all the spots? I'm gonna with Josh again, I love yeah. it! Woohoo! Normally, we're competing against each other. Today, we're on a team. I don't like this. Three, three each other, two, two one. one. <laughs> <laughs> I jumped the highest. Wow. Oh, all right, here we go. The Backcountry Baker's Brawl. Are we there yet? We've crossed three lakes so far. Ideally today we only have to drill holes on three lakes. Only three. I'm glad I don't have my carrier. They said take your bucket carrier or auger carrier off the side because you gotta be nimble. We're here. We made it an epic ride. How many lakes? Five lakes? Across five lakes. And lakes. Five lakes. The brawl is about to begin. When the first line drops, the time starts. We've assembled the dream team. Here we go. Sink, 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 sinky. I don't like being on the same team as Jay. It feels so wrong. I'm okay with being on everybody else's team, just not Jay's. Guys are drilling holes. No one's gonna fish until we start the clock. We are starting with walleyes. Probably a chance of a pike in here. Yeah. This is fun. It's fun being on the same team. You know? So what are we trying to catch here? Walleye, ideally, whitefish? Ideally walleye, whitefish, and a pike, hopefully. And a pike. No. I think we should get a we should we should probably try for a perch quick here yeah. at after. Alright, I'm gonna start with the jaw jacker and a jig and a minnow, the meathead jig. Yeah, I'll take a minnow. We got lots. So Clayton, what's the key to jig and a minnow? Jig and a minnow? It's the way you put your minnow on, just per You wanna put it on for me? No. Mac will. No, 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 no. Someone has to put my minnow on. I was told. Small minnow. Small. I mean, medium. Ah, yeah, sure. Said big or small. These are. Those ones are in gas, right? 
Uh, we're on the same team, remember. Oh, yeah, we're on the same team. Sorry, Jake. Okay, time check. Get a rod. Stop yelling. Did someone drill a hole for me. Aren't we on the same team? <laughs> Drop him down. 953, okay, we're going. Hey, for today, everyone, pistol grip. Yeah, pencil grip all day. Pistol grip is a daily tip. I'm pistol gripping. Look at this. Hey, Clay, check that out. It's the I'll wally grip. Friends off. Friends off. In honor of fishing with Clayton, I'm gonna use a chartreuse micro dinner bell. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. It's not good if they won't eat the jig in the minna. I got something. Max on. Freaking walleye. Walleye, Max got a walleye. <laughs> walleye, baby. We got a walleye, finally. First walleye. Walleye's off the board. All right, letting her go. Walleye's off the table. Ooh, ready to rip. Well, we already got one category done and I haven't even dropped down the old live scope machine. Wow, this fish is just so not wanting to eat food. Maybe it's how you're working it, Josh. Do you ever think about that? No. Maybe it's the angler? It's not even, not even close to. There's a lot of fish down here. Wow, I can't believe you've been coming. Another fish 60 feet behind me. Another fish on the bottom out there. There's a bunch of fish slith slithering around here. Do they look like perch? Oh, this guy's on my bait. Really? Got him. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's off. He's got him. No, no, he's still on. Keep reeling, keep reeling. Dang it. <sighs> Put it back. Put it back. Oh, no. Check it back. It's around my GoPro. It's around my GoPro. Oh, no, no, it's around my GoPro, Josh. Is it? Oh, no. I'm just wrapping him more. Okay, wait. Okay, we got it. Get her back in there. Disaster. Let's put that pike rod out. Let's make Josh run to this. Yeah, for sure. Flag! He's joking. No, the flag is up. I'm not joking. All right, well, we got set line for walleye, whitefish, whatever. Josh, that's your flag, by the way. All right. Oh, Kevin, should I come over? Pull the deucer? Just ignore him, ignore him. Is it still perch, Kevin? Whitefish should be cool. Keep. Whitefish, be a whitefish. <laughs> lot of guides. It's big. A lot of guys for one fish. A lot of guides. It's fighting like a walleye, buddy. Big whitey. Big whitefish. Big whitey. Oh, big whitey. Yeah. Oh wait, that's not a whitefish. That's a funny looking whitefish, you know? Well, we got walleye number two on the rattle bait. We may catch a few more walleyes. You guys might be like, why aren't you leaving? But. This spot, as Max said, could have whitefish, perch, pike, and it's gone. Good. Oh, we're gonna eat that one? Oh. I thought we were having walleye for dinner. This is Kevin's favorite bait, right? Favorite bait right there. Oh, wow, that fish came out of nowhere. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, oh he's oh, coming Josh, quick. Oh, he's coming fast. Oh, yeah, he's about to eat it. Ooh, that might be a pike. That looks decent, though, eh? Yeah, that's a good fish. But he's gonna bite this off if it's a pike. He's gonna bite it right now. Oh my gosh, this fish sucks. Do you ever sucks. wish you could just grab the rod and jig for the guy? Oh, all the time. Yeah. Should I just drop down? Yeah, I'm gonna drop down in there. I have the tongue. Should I just drop down in there? If someone would just shut up and let me catch this fish for a Look second. Look at these guys. You do not need to you do that. It's just savage. a picky fish. Please leave. I need you guys to be out of my zone right now. I'm getting pissed off. It's going back down to bottom. You got now. interference. So if you tap that middle button a couple times. Well, you're the interference. Oh, zoom. Wait one second. Zoom off. I can't tell who's who. <laughs> Jiminy crickets. Oh, he's on. Might be a perch. It honestly might be a Just perch. Just a giant perch. Oh, no! That's what happens. Oh! It was for sure a giant perch. Oh, man. That fish was so feisty, though. That took a while, though. I give Brandon a lot of credit for making Jay's videos interesting. With oh, the fish. Flag, 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 flag! Josh, that's you. Oh, it's no! Oh, no. Uh oh. Things are happening. Ah! Go, 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 go! Okay, people. Who, who did the double wrap? Is it still there? He's there, eh? No? Oh, no. Wait, it's on the ice. <sighs> okay, next time. Hey, good sign. You didn't put hooks into him. Oh, I guess that it. Fish are biting. This is good. And 
We'll be like, Jay, didn't you reel it up? Honey. <laughs> Did we just lose the rod? Is it gone? No. Is it gone? No. Oh. Did I lose a rod? Oh, yeah. No. Oh. Did that just happen? Oh. Oh. We should be able to catch it. Jay, no, a fish just yanked it so fast. Like straight gone. Does anyone have an awkward view? Oh. Oh, that's Jay. horrible. That, it took the micro dinner bomb, so it didn't break anything. Oh, <laughs> I've never lost a rod down the hole. So there's pike here. Do you think that was a pike? Huge well, the good fish. news, Jay, you still haven't lost a rod down the <laughs> hole. <laughs> oh, man, I was convinced. That was pretty good. Wow, you sold that. That was really good. That was really good. He even did a belly oh, dive. Oh, man. <laughs> that was phenomenal. That was good. You're a good actor. I was okay, I'm like, at least Clayton got a head cam, it's gonna be good footage. I'm impressed. That was good. So what, are we gonna give it like 15 more minutes and then go try that point? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh man. That'd be a tough show. That flag's gotta go again. I know. Hooked up to something. What? What, Max on. Come on, don't be a walleye, don't be a walleye. It's a perch! It's a perch! Yeah! Woo! Let's yeah! go! Let's go! That's a big perch! Pop belly perch! Not too shabby for northern Manitoba. That is a big That's perch for up here. Big. Super red fins, eh? That's a good surprise. Dude, I knew we could do it. Well, we were seeing like, the ones we were seeing on the electronics were like that big. That's. That's a proper perch. It's a real perch, buddy. Carrying the team right here, Carrying Mr. Mack. All right, we gotta move to whitefish, baby. Ideally, we gotta try to get a pike and whitefish next. And then we'll focus on the lake trout and burbot at the same spot. Heck yeah, baby. These guys gotta start producing though. Seriously slacking. It's hard carrying a bunch of guys like this, you know? They're hard on you and they don't even provide. It's tough, tough crowd. Well, that was a good start. The panfish, the perch was a great surprise. Not a small one either. We, we got some nice fish. Obviously, size doesn't matter for this challenge. We're just going straight on time and we're trying to hit those seven categories. We got two down. So we have like the deeper water here, yeah. but just over we have a little reef that we could potentially catch whitefish on too. Like we'll probably drill a couple holes on it and pan around with the live scope. Someone should fish beside me with the uh, live scope. Do you want to do that, Clayton? Sure. Finally, I got to hang out with Jay. <laughs> it's taken years. Well, we're back. Fishing lake number two. Uh, once again, Mac will probably pull us through with a lake trout, burbot, and whitefish. It's good. good thing we both have a head camera on. This looks really good. A couple dummies. We're gonna have great angles. We should be split. That's why we weren't, shouldn't be fishing together. Ooh, look at that. Suspended fish cruising in. That ain't no perch. Oh yeah. That looks Cisco-like. Oh, Clayton's, oh, burbot. It's gonna be a burbot. We got a burbot. Right on the bottom. Are we gonna get tangled? Very likely. All right. Oh, oh, I'm in, I'm tangled with you. Okay, open my bail. Shit. I'm gonna pull the deucer out. Oh, and that happened. It... Yeah, weird. Did I hit it with the transducer when I, I pulled know. it out? I don't know. No, I don't think so. Oh yeah, that was definitely, are we tangled or no? No, we weren't. That was 100% a burbot. Well, Ouch. that wasn't like tiny, tiny. No, it was a nice burbot. Sorry, Clayton. You didn't do anything wrong. I'm sorry. It was all, it just, it was just a coincidence. Do you think that was actually a burbot? 100%. Come on. Ooh, what do we got here? Another Cisco cruising in? Or a Laker maybe. Laker. Yeah, that's a decent sized fish. Oh, 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 oh my goodness, Clayton. Come on. Yeah, dude. <laughs> that was ridiculous. 
That fish was gonna eat one of us. Oh, that's a Laker for sure. Oh, that was ridiculous. That thing went nuts. Come on, baby. That was fun. Man, that fish had some speed. Well, we just set up on this main lake point that Mac chose for us. And uh, yeah, 40 feet of water. I had a little jigging spoon on. And we might have a lake trout. Oh, it's little, but it, it's a Laker. Yeah! <laughs> Category three. Size? Achieved. Didn't matter. Nice. They do have a different uh, dark, like a backcountry look. It's Yeah, it's holy. It's just it's way darker, hey? Okay, good. Back in. Okay. Yeah! Did we win? Did we win? <laughs> okay, let's fish again. Because there was Burba down there too. That fish wanted to get hooked. Oh man, that was fun. It's going pretty well so far. 11.55 a.m. That's good. Did, do, we have a, do we have a time when we actually started? Yeah, I think it's got set on film. 9.53 or 9.52? 9 9.50, 9.50 I think. Hey Mac, was it 9.53? Hooked up! Max on. Kobe and Burbit! Burbit? I'm guessing it hit a bunch of minnows on the bottom. Get him! <laughs> Definitely gonna be a Burbit. Dirty burp. Definitely gotta be a burber to hit. It just, I put on a, like five minnows on a jig and just hit off the bottom. Oh, we got the burber! Hey! Let's go! Woo! Oh, well, that's easy. Crossing them off. It's like they gotta bite it. Dirty burb. Look at that. It's actually pretty too. Not too bad. Burbit is off the list. Daytime burbit. Not an easy feat. Daytime burb. Let's go, baby. Okay, we just need a whitefish. We had a Cisco there too, Jason. You're gonna put something small in for a Cisco? Yeah. Yeah, no point using this anymore. This is reminiscent of Game of Inches with how good things went for us at the start and then it came unraveled. So I don't wanna jinx it, but uh, we've got two more categories and it's before noon. Wild. Oh, we gotta catch a pike. I kind of forgot about that. So a situation like this, it's when a tungsten lure really shines. It's denser than lead. So you can get a smaller lure falling deep. So I got this micro dinner bell now and we're fishing in 40 feet, 43 feet. So nice depth for Cisco's white fish. And I think we saw some swimming around. So, oh, there's a Laker coming in. <laughs> that is definitely a Laker. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, okay maybe Laker. <laughs> <laughs> I'll grab your, I'll grab the deucer. Thank you. I'll get my rod out of the hole here. What I was gonna say before this fish came in is so many people, yeah, you're good come up to Athapap for the big Lakers. Yesterday we had a banner day. But the thing is you look at a map and you look where Baker's Narrows is and there's endless lakes. And that's kind of why we wanted to do today just to show all of the options. Right now we're catching smaller Lakers. Yeah, Athapap, you might go and just get a couple bites a day. You go to some of these backcountry lakes and you're gonna see anything. We don't know what's gonna bite, right? As well, the scenery here was spectacular. So I think, you know, Obviously, Athapap is most known for its giant Lakers, thanks to Clayton, but... It's the adventure of the backcountry. Like, it's just so cool to, like, take off and just... Yeah, I don't even know the name of this lake that we're on right now, and it's like, we're hammering fish. And you're never gonna know the I'll name I'll never of know, lake. yeah. And they eat, they just come in and eat. Yeah, these fish are dumb. That's your second Laker in, like, no time. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's, that is a little hook. Okay, okay. <laughs> she look at that little hook. <laughs> that was awesome. Jay, do you want to hold your fish? No, you can you hold good? it. You're good? Nice. J-bomb. Fishing with Jay. It's been a while. Yeah, usually we fish against each other, not with each other. It's good to be on the same team. Nice. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. You, right. you called it Laker, too. It's all conscious about how I hold my rod now. I like holding like this. Five minutes. No. Five minutes, Jay says. Let's go now. You guys have Dollar wasted fish enough time. Under us. Four minutes remaining till we switch lakes. I'll never fish all the lakes around Canara. Oh, God, Cisco. Oh, come on. Come on. This is it. Oh, come on. This is yes, it. yes, yes, yes. I got yes. him. Yes. It's tiny. Yes. It is tiny. Get that deuce route. I will. I will. I don't want to hit your line. This is going to be the smallest Cisco ever, or it's a perch. Come on. Cisco, Cisco, Cisco. Yeah! Yeah, yeah buddy! We did it! 
Can I eat it? <laughs> <laughs> it's so small. This one we're gonna keep for bait. Yeah, that's definitely bait. Look at that. He, uh, that was perfect. Wow, that's small. That is a little Cisco. Hey, we, we never said we're chasing big ones today. We're just chasing different species. We got two, we got two species left only. Pike and stock trout. Let's do it. We're gonna finish it off. We're taking this guy with us, so. I'm gonna just slide him in my pocket. He's, That's yeah. a pocket-sized fish right there. We're gonna win! You guys, we're gonna win! We will win! So good, we're packing up and we're switching lakes once again. Pike, and then we gotta switch lakes for stock trout. We're on a good pace, 12.38. Yeah. Pike, this is where we won game inches, right here. Um, this is strictly pike, only pike. We're gonna set out some dead baits, maybe jig some rattle baits. Yeah. Looks like we're at the mouth of uh, a creek, a spawning bay of sorts. Um, these spots get better later in the year. Uh, January, this isn't like a great time to necessarily fish these, but they do kind of always hang out here. I feel like January, you can kind of catch fish all over the lake, but there's always fish that hang around in the creeks. Did I do a good job, Mac? Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. That's like good Anything you'd add or? No, no, I think you did good. Thank you. Well, we're setting the old dead bait. You should get a time lapse of Jay just trying to set up those finicky foolers. They're literally dummy proof. That's why they call it a fooler. Yeah, and it takes Jay like an hour. Sorry, is someone using the bait we just caught? We need to use it. Where's the fish? It's in that cooler in the back of my sleigh. Here's the fish I just caught. The second one I'm gonna get set up much faster. Let's do a timer. The, the, where's the finicky fooler? I just see the fool. I just see the fool. <laughs> so glad that Jay came out, came along with us today. Where are you going, bro? Yo, relax. Do you want me just to tow your sled back? These people are all gonna shut their mouths when I catch a 49 inch Northern Pike. Like how does it even take you that long, buddy? These guys give me a hard time trying this new tip up device. It's all right. They're gonna be quiet when I'm reeling a monster pike. I'll knock that head cam right off your head. I wanna see you guys fight to the death. Either Mac makes Jay bleed or we have to catch a stock trout. What's more painful? Stock trout will be no problem. We'll hit it at prime time. We just, the pike now, we just, if Josh wouldn't have messed up that pike this morning. Oh, well, Clayton double wrapped it on the finicky fooler. You guys give me a hard time, but that's why we lost that fish. Yeah, someone did double wrap it, Clayton. I don't think I put it. No, you did. No, you did. No, you, you did. did. <laughs> you did. I didn't double wrap it though. No, triple you said? Did you catch any big fish like my pig? You're just not really good at catching big fish, eh? I just don't, yeah, it's not my thing. Oh, fight, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. fight. Let's go, bro, let's go, bro. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. All right. You're good, you're trying to shine. Oh. Still there. I thought he lost it for sure. Oh. You wanna grab the pliers off the back of my sled there? Oh man, I was just enjoying some lunch. It's not tiny. This is light fluoro on here. It's just heavy, it's just a big pike. Yeah. Should we get the bump board too or no? Uh, we don't need to measure it. What if it's like really big? It might be really big. It's fighting really big. It feels big now. Wish I didn't tie light fluoro with this. Oh, it feels big. We got the Mr. Big on here. Yeah. This is with the Cisco that I caught. Ridiculous. <laughs> this is the Cisco I caught. I was taking the rod after you guys gave me such a hard time with setting up these finicky foolers. <laughs> well, you are slow. The flag actually went up, so that's a pretty good sign. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah. Get in here, Clayton. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> yeah, boy. Yeah. 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 There we go. We don't just catch small fish, we catch good ones. Once in a while, Jay finally Once did in a while it. I catch this fish. I can't even believe it. 40, 40, almost 40. 41? 41 and a half. Matto Master Angler. 41 and three quarters. Dude, Matto Master Angler, Jay. That's a 
All right. Well, we only got one pike, but it's uh, it's a big a big mama, Whew. with the Cisco that we caught. She gone? Someone's not gonna say make a comment about how it filled up a ten inch hole. <laughs> I thought about it. I just thinking about that. Barbless hook. All right. Pop right out. Yeah, and the barbless hook pop right out. All the cliches. We got one left. One it is the stock trout. We're moving. We're rolling. Team out. Well, that was fun. We freaking did it! Let's go, baby! Woo! All right, we are at our last category, which Matt didn't want to include. Let's be honest. I didn't want to include it. I wasn't too sure. You've never fished this lake. I never, honestly, honestly, I've never fished this lake. We're on Scotty Lake. It's no surprise if you look at the stocking list, there's not many stocked lakes up here. It's got what, rainbows, tigers? And, uh, it's, and brook trout, brook. yeah. Brook, rainbow, tiger. Our plan of attack, probably some small jigging spoons, some jaw jackers with some trout dough. There have been giants. Like there's been 28 inch rainbows caught here back in the day. I think there's a master and a couple entered in 2022. So there, there's some big fish in here. It's a pretty small lake, but uh, these small lakes, they, they don't get a ton of pressure really. People are here for Lakers and other things, but you can grow some big trout up here. My goal for today is to earn a chicken burger. <laughs> perch. There's, there's so much crap going on right now. It's gotta be a perch, eh? <laughs> for it. It's gotta be just like a bunch of perch, oh, eh? Oh, they're just stacked. Look at that one come. That's gonna be like at least four inches, that one. Just eventually one's gotta be like a wow. small brook trout. Eventually one's gotta be just a small brook trout. <laughs> one, they're so tiny. <laughs> you can have them. <laughs> All right, we're going minnow on jaw jacker. Well, we got the jaw jacker set and we're jigging or the other guys are. This would be pretty tough to beat. Like things have to go pretty smooth for you to to do this well maybe like uh 15 hours in the mar March oh true april. in april yeah you could do it i don't think i think beating the time would be tough but i think like yeah do you have a rod i can put on another jaw jacker i'm just gonna keep setting jaw jackers for all you guys well just set another jaw jacker for the guys but uh i mean that's the thing anytime you fish a new lake it can feel hopeless at the start but i was looking at the stocking list they have stocked you know every couple of years they stock a few thousand fish in here like we said there's tigers there's brooks there's browns uh, i'm gonna go back to jigging but I'm confident we'll catch something. That big pike was a huge bonus. I'd love to see a big trout, but any trout, I mean, we'll make it happen. So yeah, we'll just keep grinding. Looks like Keevan Brandon's focused on you. He's calling you the shot right now. No, he's shooting through Keevan at me. Oh, that's a way bigger mark. Way bigger than what I've been seeing. Geez, that could have been a trout. Oh yeah. yeah. Bring it home, Josh. Got it. No, oh, he's actually hooked up. Yeah! 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 Oh! yeah, baby! Persistence pays off. What's the time? What's the time? What's the time? Oh, I just knew that was a trout. 346. 346. Look at that beautiful fish. <laughs> What a beauty! Oh, look at that. Ah, how did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> Five fifty-four. Five hours and fifty-four minutes. Under six hours. Five hours and fifty-four minutes. Clayton's math is either going to be right or wrong, right here. Five fifty-four. Under six hours for seven species, species of fish. There's another one down there. Get him, Baker's Narrows Lodge. If you can get. All categories in one day, you gotta do it, you know, with a guide to verify it, but then you can add a night to your stay next time you come back. We'll have all the specific details in the bottom, but anyways, it's, uh, Athapap is amazing. That lake has some of the biggest lake trout in North America, but if you want something different, this was an incredible adventure. How many lakes? Three, four lakes? Yeah, we, I mean, we went over, I think six lakes and we fished four of them. Ridiculous. We saw a lot of new water and it's just like, there's so many other lakes you could fish too. You could do this so many different ways. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. That's spectacular. Just a great sled adventure too. Oh, I don't think that could have gone too much smoother. I'm glad we got one big fish in there too. That was nice. <laughs> Woo! I'm glad that happened. Good job, buddy. Boo! 
One more thing for this video completely wraps up. Make sure to subscribe to Clayton on YouTube. He's creeping up to the 100,000 subscriber mark. Let's help him get there. And Mac has started a YouTube channel. Let's help him out as well. I'll link them both below. You can follow Josh as well. He does some cool cooking stuff. <laughs>